Hamlin University, obviously, for us, uh, you know, the focal point has always been um, our relationship with the Port Authority in terms of um, the ICE arena. As we start to look around um, to try to find a permanent home for Hamlin University, both our men's and women's hockey program, um, you know, word was certainly out as um, cooling systems were going to need to be revamped at a lot of the local municipal facilities as well as um, even some of the facilities that were on MIAC campuses. And um, fortunately for us, we had a connection a little bit to uh, the Minnesota Wild and just exploring, we knew that they had a need in terms of a practice facility um, and enter a phone call from someone like Lee Kruger and um, that kind of spearheaded um, the conversation and bringing the groups together and, and um, creating a vision, which essentially that vision has come to reality. So, um, you know, we're grateful for the relationship because without them, I don't know that we wouldn't have been able to get the project done. They're really spearheaded, um, bringing together a lot of notable groups to, you know, have a finished product um, like Tree of Rinks. The impact has been amazing, but because of Tree of Rink, you know, for us, we've been allowed to have a permanent home for a men's and women's hockey program. But it's impacted not only, you know, um, our institution, I should say, but um, really our hockey programs to a great degree. And um, providing a, a permanent home for men's and women's hockey and our student athletes to have an amazing experience, which um, really you can't measure. And so we're very grateful for that. So now that we have a home, it's been, we've been able to use this place as home ice advantage. Uh, to walk into this rink is pretty intimidating, uh, just with the glass and, and uh, having our locker room space and, and all the amenities, it's, it's been a home ice advantage for us. Uh, on the, the second step of, of then continuing to make Hamlin good each year is the recruiting piece. Um, to bring recruits into this rink, there's no other rink like this in the state, there's probably no other rink like this in the country. Uh, and so to call this place home, to call a tree rink home, and to be able to bring future recruits for Hamlin into here and uh, paint the picture or paint a vision of what it would be like for them to come here for the next four years to play uh, is a competitive advantage that, frankly, no other D3 school, uh, possibly no other D1 school has. So we're really lucky to call this place home. Tria Rink has already made a phenomenal impact on, on Hamlin hockey, and, and moving forward in the years to come, uh, we have a 25-game regular season schedule, seven of those being non-conference games. All five of our conference games are played here. That means we travel on the road for two non-conference games. Case in point, it means people want to come here and play us. And that's a huge competitive advantage to be at home every single day. Realistically, um, we're playing majority about 80% of our games here. Um, and that's people want to come here. 